Ten days to go before we flip the 48, right? Final stretch at Harley Ruder's headquarters. This Democrat aims to unseat 30-year Republican incumbent Dana Rohrbacher. What does he say about homelessness? It's a lifestyle choice. His position on homeowners not having to sell their homes to LGBTQ individuals. Yes, he did say that. He supports offshore drilling off our beautiful coast. And we're not going to let him do that, are we? No. no. Supporters are targeting sympathizers who might not plan to vote and to win over those who voted Republican for Congress before but don't like President Trump. Historically, Orange County has been extremely conservative, but we're here to flip the district. The Republicans that lived here and always have are not the same ones that are being represented by Trump. Voters here resoundingly rejected Donald Trump for president two years ago. This district's congressional representative is one of Trump's most fervent supporters. We have a lot of moderate Republicans who have joined our campaign. In fact, you'll even see signs out in the area that say Republicans for Harley. And, and again, that is, uh, shows how extreme Dana Rohrabacher has become, as well as even Donald Trump. And there are people here that are saying enough is enough. Orange County embodies America's newest political divide, a traditional Republican enclave in a deeply Democratic state. At an early voting station where people are already casting ballots, the contrast is clear. I'm a strong conservative Christian, and uh, I just want our nation to be one nation under God. We need to make some changes here with the, with the current leadership. We've got to make that change, and that's why I've got to be here. The candidates are neck and neck in the polls. So a Democratic Party superstar has come to help. The mayor of Los Angeles lends a hand in Orange County's Latino neighborhoods. Gracias por su apoyo. Gracias. Latinos usually support Democrats, but don't always vote. Latinos are now 50 percent of the population in the area, but many times have not had a voice that stands for them. Right now we have a, a president and Congress who are literally dividing this country based on ethnicity, based on immigration status. We know in these communities how strong family is and we will protect those families. You guys want to take a picture of the next congressman? Yeah. None of the Orange County Republican candidates we contacted allowed us to follow them, perhaps a sign of how nervous they are about a democratic wave.